Well, it is a chilly fall day to head to the Bloomsburg Fair, and there's a lot happening there today. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Chris Bohinski is at the fairgrounds in Columbia County. He joins us now live. Hi, Chris. Hey, Candace. Yes, I'm with my new friend Dave. And Dave, we are inside your truck, but before we get into uh, making your most famous thing, talk to us about what the name of your stand is and what you uh, offer to the people here at the fair. Sure. It's the uh, Bacon Bomb stand, so obviously we offer Bacon Bombs, and it's on the corner of C and 9th at the Bloomsburg Fair. Yes. So, uh, a Bacon Bomb, what does that entail? Well, we take thick-cut bacon and we weave it together, and then we put Italian sausage on top of that, then crumbled bacon, cheddar cheese, our own barbecue sauce, and our own dry rub. The whole thing gets rolled into a log and smoked, then we put it on the grill and turn it into a sandwich. I can show you some on the smoker if you want. Absolutely, yes, please. Our wonderful photographer, Joey Dominic, will follow you as we go and see this in the smoker. Here's the sun that just went on. And these are a couple that are almost done. All right. Okay, so then once they're out of that smoker, do you do something right here on the grill? Are you hungry yet? Make sure you remember, if you come to the Bloomsburg Fair today, ages 13 to 18, so students that are watching, you are free today. So if you're thinking, oh, I have no money, 13 to 18 year olds, make your way down to the fair because it is free for you today. Okay, so is that one serving? That's one serving, no, it's not <laughs> one serving. So this is the bacon bomb when it comes off the smoker. We cut the end off, like so. Then we give you a nice slice. We take that end, we chop it up nice and small. And remember, you know, the Bloomsburg Fair is Pennsylvania's largest agricultural fair, but that entails a lot of stuff. So of course you see the animals here and the games and uh, all of the arts and crafts, but so much good food. Even if you just wanted to come down to the fair for dinner tonight, do it. Why not be spontaneous? Have a little bit of fun. The sun is, is out now. There's really, yeah, some clouds in the sky and it is a little chilly here. So having a bacon bomb to warm me up sounds like a great plan. So then what, Dave? Okay, so next, get back over here. Was that some homemade barbecue sauce? Yep. That is. Take the bacon bomb, we hit it with a little cheese. Then we take the chop. Goes right on top. And what does it mean for you to be able to, you know, share your love of food with all the smiling faces here at the fair? Oh, it's the best feeling ever. We absolutely love it. Just hit this with a little water to melt the cheese. Yum, yum, yum. I don't know if you can hear that sizzle, but it is sizzling, it is melting, it is all good. Now, if you were watching PA Live a little bit earlier, you might have seen us at Eat the Bowl. This is right down the, the road from Eat the Bowl. Uh, and a little bit later in the news, we'll be at Paul's Famous Stuffed Pretzels. They're all kind of right here in a uh, little uh, triangle of sorts. Okay, now what is this, the finisher? Right, and then our homemade barbecue sauce right over the top. And that is the bacon bomb. And look at that. So Dave, well, we appreciate you making us a bacon bomb. Remember, you can come down here. Gates close at 9. Ages 13 to 18 are free today. Candice, it seems like I can wrap that up in foil. Maybe I'll be bringing that home for you. You uh, keep holding down the fort in the studio. Man, I, Chris, I thank you so much. I wish we could smell that because it looks so good. It does. It, I'm going to try it now. <laughs> All right. Okay, we'll see you in a little while. Thanks, Chris.